What's up guys, it's your boy Pain because everybody shall know Pain. This is the first gameplay of Elite Match. Let's go and get in, let's get into it, shall we? I already uploaded the, the first gameplay of the, my actual daily routine of Ninja Class, but now we're going to do Elite Matches. Elite Matches is basically, um, you, you, you go up against other players from, it's an element combined of every single um, player of every single, well actually, yeah, it's um, you battle people from other servers, and you know, try to be the best, try to be the number one, and then uh, along with that, um, you gain um, dang, what was these things? You gain on um, points, challenge points, which you can use to recruit ninjas from the um, I think it's um, that tavern, it's the the challenge shop there. It's a challenge shop. But yeah, my folks, my first opponent. Go ahead, demolish him real quick. <laughs> oh man, universal pool. And that is it. Now time for the next battle. The first six, and then after the six, I think it's on five. Then it's down to four, then it's down to two, and then now it's, then, then, then it's down to one. And yeah, everything is based on race. So it's like, um, if I beat these six people, it's kind of like, it's like the next day, when doing elite matches, my rank might be a tad bit higher than you take on other. You take on another set of people um, always. So it's kind of like sometimes you might get you might um come you might um some people drop ranks so they can um be able to defeat all eighteen opponents in one every single day. But it's like you know in the sense of if you want to drop ranks, you have to um you can what you can do is you can leave your main in the formation, which your main has to be in the formation, but you can leave him by himself. And then that allows you to drop a few ranks, and then you can then easily um start elite matches again, and then start um defeating people left and right, left and right, getting those um challenge points. Sukiyomi. Oh, but he has the um Son Goku, the Four Tails. What level? Level eight, and I have my level um eight Five Tails Kokuo. By Toby Rama, Nagito, Itachi, me, and Renegon Sasuke, which Renegon is spelled way too many ends. It's spelled I, I mean, my, not I, R, R, I, N, N, N. It's supposed to be two N's, not three N's. And then G, A, N, N. And then when it says Renegon, it's supposed to be only three N's in Renegon, but it got about five N's. <laughs> Good Lord. <laughs> Some of like a big typo. Well, low again, loading up for the third battle. And he has Toby and Sani Naruto, which is also by the name of Sage Naruto. Now, uh, on Toby, his special, which he's about to do right now, it um you on uh, your ninjas gradually start on your know, your ninjas gradually lose HP each turn, it's like a burn damage. What well, is burn? But Toby's not really that good. He's decent. If you want to use them. But my guys don't even care. Whew. With Nagato being able to um drop Fairy by, I think, on what? It originally is only 25 points, but then when you give him certain accessories, like he does, I think, 33 or 30, I think 35 or 33 is his highest right now. Togarama can drop Assault on Fairy. And, yeah, stun him and drop Fairy. And then Luge Guy can raise his own Fairy by 25. And then that's really it. Sukiyomi. Boy, I, I hey, I can I can't wait um until I get on um, White Coast Sasuke. I mean, he's gonna be so OP, man. What I mean, I know. I mean, that's the one ninja that's like you know. Again, what I had mentioned in my um, my previous video is that he's the best out of um any current um. At, he's the best out of any current um assault that you get in this game, and at the same time being that he's better than any event ninja that you can get as a um assault assaulter. So it's like, hey, man, like for me, it's like. I ain't got to spend money for him. I just got to do tournament every single day. I get him. My team's going to be way better. I mean, if I do end up getting, a, if I do end up getting a um, event ninja, that'll be, some, be probably sometime next week. Not, ne not next week. Next year if I want to, if I even can. But um, I do want to try to get um, a Renner on a reanimation Itachi, which is a Vanguard. They got Susano Itachi, which is a Salter. You got Luja Guy Itachi, which I have right now. And Susano Itachi. Not Susano um re reanimation um Itachi. I wanna probably I wanna get him. Originally I wanted Susano Itachi. But I was like, you know what? Since I wanna end up getting Sasuke, I don't need him. 
Plus, I don't got the money for him right now anyway. So I just um, well, I would like to get the reanimation um Itachi. Oh, that's our story. It's a pain with his stuns and drop fairy. Universal pool. So Roman comes in, can drop. Yeah, his highest right now is 67 points. Thanks to his accessory. And then um Itachi should bop all four of his um his supports and assaulters. Yep, and leave Sasuke all by himself to defend. Oh, he dodged it. But yeah, Renegon Sasuke, as you guys can see, is the upgraded version of regular of um just that so that Sasuke right there. And bye bye. Now we got two more. Whew. I know that um when doing this, they do end up giving you like a title on um, sometimes. I th I, forget, I think the title is name. I I, mean, I had it. I had it a couple of times. And for some reason, it'll be you'll only end up losing it. I mean, not even using it, but you'll end up losing it after a couple of days. But I know that by doing this, um, after you beat all the um, current ninja, like right now, if I beat all six of them, you have a chance to be able to get that particular title. Oh man, his um Chia went first. That's gonna that's gonna be a problem. So he's gonna be able to um drop my fury on my um supports, and then Toby Rama this then is gonna be able to drop fury on my um soldiers. So I might lose this battle. It's a chance I could, but I'm not gonna skip. It. I want to skip, it, but I'm not gonna skip it. Okay, dang, drop fear all over the place then. It's going to be a tough battle. Uh, double stun, dang it. And I get stunned and get so touch and get stunned. Yeah, it's because like, that's just going to mean it's getting, getting pounded. And that was a loss. Let me see, who was that? That was an assassin ace. Oh, okay. Well, let's take on 69. This is going to take on this person right here, and I end the video. But yeah, most of the time, when it comes down to doing elite, I don't, I'm, I don't want to do elite every single day because of the fact that I know that sometimes I'm, I'm going to get matched to where I can't be everybody. But I mean, I don't know. I, I haven't fully came to a decision if I want to just keep just do elite every single day, no matter what. But this person has um, beast formation, so I easily be able to defeat him or her. Even though the um, ninja is a girl, it could be guys. A guy might like to use the um, girl ninja character. Universal pool should take them all out, and he will. So no, he's not. He's gonna live with a tad bit, of, a little bit of HP love. Well, apparently he is strong because of the fact that he has the seven tails and I'm the five tails. So definitely, I lucked out with him using his beast formation. But that is it. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Like, leave a comment. Don't forget to subscribe, and I'll catch you guys later. Deuces.